am back here to do my first Afro Puff as a natural. And I like refreshing my curls with a little bit of my mix, my spray bottle mix. And that just helps me to wake my hair up and helps it get into the right direction for the puff. And I believe here I was working with a two-day-old two wash and go here. So it really didn't take much for me just to get my hands on through with my moisture mix and just kind of finger comb it on through. And as my moisturizer of choice, I will be using the Kids Organic Shea Butter. And it is a very light moisturizer with water as the first ingredient. And I find by using a light moisturizer, it just gives my hair a little bit more of a fluffier feel to it. And the smell of this product is heavenly. It smells absolutely divine. And I believe I got it at my local Walmart. And here you will see me just smoothing the moisturizer through my hair, just trying to coat each section evenly. Now as the extra moisturizer, I'll be using the Allocate Naturals Moisture Rich Hair Parfait. And I like using this product just around my edges before I start applying the gel. And a little bit of this product goes a long way. After I'm finished smoothing my hair with both of the moisturizers, I will be using none other than the famous Echo Stylo Gel, the olive oil kind. And I've used a lot of this product over the last year since my transition and also now natural, but I'm going to have to replace it here pretty soon. I'll be using my Boar Bristle brush and it is a very soft brush that I like using around my edges to smooth in the gel. And this is a very soft brush that's not damaging to your edges. Here I'm using the Goodies Headband and I've used this so many times you all that I've actually stretched it out so it's not too uncomfortable around my head. And you'll see here how I'm just tying it around simple here and just applying one piece at a time and smoothing all the way through to make sure there is no kinks or knots. And I'm taking the other part and doing the same. And I find taking my hands and just forming a complete circle around the puff really creates a uniform look to the style. And of course, at your liberty, you can just fluff out your puff and get it to your desired height and width and just have fun with it. This completes the look. You can add your favorite hair accessory of your choice or you can just wear your puff as is. You all take care. I had a great time. Bye-bye.